Hello, my name is Grant Hearn. I'm Professor of o Ocean Engineering Science and I'm in the Engineering Faculty. And one of my responsibilities is the MSc Coordinator for the Marine Engineering Sciences, but I also look after the MSc generally within the Faculty of, of Engineering and the Environment. Right, having said who I am, what I'm going to talk about is the interim report. Every, every student has to produce this interim report in, 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 so that his, his preparation can be assessed in terms of whether or not he understands the question or the topic that's to be addressed, whether he has sorted out exactly what the aim of the project is, what's to be discovered, what's to be measured, what's to be investigated, and, and the objectives. How will he go about actually achieving those aims and what facilities will he require. Now because the literature review is very much a part of the final dissertation, the interim report does not include a literature review, but at the same time it expects you to have researched the literature so that you can justify either the methods, whether they be theoretical or experimental, as and, and therefore the actual techniques you're going to use, you can actually argue why they are appropriate to the actual challenge of the MSc. Now the interim report is worth 10%. Now if you look at any academic module, um, they're typically, if they're 10 credits, they're 100 hours, if they're 15 credits, 150 hours. And in this case, um, the interim report is worth 10% and essentially it's roughly worth 70 hours. So it actually does require you to invest some time in its preparation in terms of thinking about what am I going to do, how am I going to do it, what sort of support do I need in terms of investigation experimentally, what sort of computer programs do I need in terms of uh, theoretical analysis, uh, are those programs available in the university or do I have to seek special favours from companies who have specialist software? So the idea is, is that it's to show, the interim report is to show that you've actually thought about the problem, how it can be tackled, how you're going to organise it and the resources that you need and a clear indication of justification of what it is that you've decided.